so okay, I mean, in, well, I was going to originally plan this, like, last week, but I never get around to this. So yeah, uh, the title of this, uh, vlog, or vlog, is going to be called, Ranking Every Borderlands Game. All the way from the first one to Titan Tans Wonderlands, because, uh, I'm not going to add the new, um, one that came out, like, three months ago, because, uh, if y'all know, that game failed and nobody cares about it. I'm just saying that in my opinion, because I know, as a Borderlands fan, and a lot of people do not like Tales from the Borderlands, the new one that's like the Telltale game, but, uh, yeah. So, here we go. First one. Now, the four, first one came out in 2009 on PlayStation 3, Xbox 360, six years later... Well, actually, 10 years later, came out on Xbox One, and a year later came out on Nintendo Switch, with the other th three games, like, well, most definitely the other two, but, yeah. So, I'm gonna give that a 10 out of 10. So, Borderlands 2 came out on PlayStation 3, Xbox 360, VR, uh, PS Vita, hmm... Xbox One, PS4, same thing with the first game, that also came out on PS4, which I forgot to say that, had earlier, uh, Nintendo Switch, with the first game, so, yeah, um, the cover art is orange, has, like, the characters in the background on it, and the psycho in the middle, doing, like, the little Hardy Boys, uh, taunt from before... Uh, the Hardy Boys went back to the E years later, but besides the point. So I'm going to give this a 9.5 out of 10. Borderlands, the pre-sequel. Now, um, not the best game, but, uh, but I wish you could do better with it. Like, give us, like, a little bit more references to the characters, Easter eggs from other games, just like they did with Song of the Hedgehog. Battle Shock and um well uh Super Mario Family Guy Buzz Lightyear from Toy Story so yeah um but uh Borderlands pre sequel I'm gonna give it an 8 out of 10 and then finally Borderlands 3 now Yes, Borderlands 3 came out seven years after Borderlands 2. And I gotta admit, um, it's just fun, but was really weird. They have like a. They actually have like a whole bunch of Easter eggs. Like they referenced The Undertaker from Today E. One Punch Man. Uh, a Demogorgans from Stranger Things. And all those other movie references, like The Shining and all that. I mean, what could go wrong with, with adding a few references for movies, video games, and Easter eggs? So I'm going to give the 9 out of 10. And let's get to the spinoffs first. Except for the new tales for the Borderlands, because like I said, nobody cares about that game since after... That game failed miserably. Failed out on purpose. And that's why I'm not going to add it in the game. Because I never played the game. So. Tales from the Borderlands. is a Tattletale game. That's based on the app. That re-came out on the PlayStation 3. Xbox 360. Xbox One. And PS4. But I don't think it never came out on Nintendo Switch. But it doesn't really matter. But uh. Yeah. Uh, I'm gonna give that, uh, 10 out of 10, actually. I mean, we love Telltale Games, but sadly, Telltale Games is no longer with us. But, uh, yeah. And the last, last one I'm gonna mention, yes, I actually did unbox this last year, and that is Tiny Tina's Wonderlands. Now, Tiny Tina's Wonderlands... It's a 2022, a 2022 game that came out last March that has Andy Samberg, 
Will Arnett, Wander Skies, and the voice actress who voiced Chloe from Live is Strange and Cassie Cage from Mortal Kombat X. Like, uh, do now this version is like a role playing game, like a role play game, shooter game that's like Dungeon and, Dungeon and Dragons, which has like Dark Souls reference, including the hat episode reference from. From the episode of Spongebob where Mr. Krabs tried to get the, um, well, you know, uh, hat from the skeleton fish. And then, uh, he got surrounded by, like, a whole bunch of ske skeletons. So that one I'm going to have to give a 9.5 out of 10. So that's it. That's my every rank, my rank of every Borderlands game that came out. Except the new tales for the Borderlands. Because like I said, I said it like twice. Nobody cares about that one. And I hope you guys like, comment, and subscribe.